Well, we woke up this morning pretty early in the town of El Tunco with the plan of getting an early start to go see the Tamanique waterfalls. But uh, La Bocana was breaking, the waves were good. So even though I was gonna take a day off, I couldn't resist and went out for a session, which led to a breakfast, which led to a nap. But now it's, um, it's only 11.20 in the morning and we are in the town of Pamanike and we are walking through the town to the trail and we're heading to the waterfalls. So we're back on track with today's plan. We have to have a tour guide. Right, we're trying to walk the trail ourselves, but they're insisting that we need a tour guide. And that's gonna cost us $7 per person. So, and uh, it's not too bad. If you book a tour in town, it's a lot more expensive. And we got here in our rental car, which I'll give you some information on that. If you plan to rent a car while you're here in El Salvador, do not do it in San Salvador. We waited till we got to El Tunco and we actually rented a car from a convenience store and it's less than half the cost. We're paying $40 a day for a pretty nice Kia Soul. And um, the convenience store is about a quarter mile from El Tunco. So if we need it a day, we go get it. If we don't need it, we don't get it. And uh, it's very convenient and it's actually saving us a lot of money. So. I'm not going to complain too much about this $7, but if you look, you can see the cemetery down there. But the most concerning thing are these clouds here, but we're going to jump in the water anyway, so it really doesn't matter. But it's a cute little town. And if you're wondering who these people are that are following me, this is Joe and Milena. They are staying in the house with me that we rented in El Tunco, and uh, we go back way, way too long to even mention. Buenas. Buenas. That was quite a wobble for 11.30 in the morning. Joe said, very impressive. Guess there's not a lot more. I guess once you've seen the waterfalls. That's about all there is to do here in Tamanike. So these women with the bowl on their head, they're going door to door, selling, I uh, heard her say, potatoes, yucca. The other woman, I believe, is selling oranges. And here we have uh, someone else with a good morning wobble coming our direction. I brought my crap, but I didn't have no tennis shoes when I came over here. <laughs> they are the where I stay. You're, you're ready for swimming? Yeah, that you're one, yeah. Uh -huh. and, if it, and if it rains, better. You're better. We still want to get wet. <laughs> we'll, we'll have wet shoes. Yes. Okay, our guide showed up. It was seven apiece, and we have two more people in our group. Yes. And we are okay. on our way to the waterfall. Fuck yeah. Do you want to go? Oh. I'm right in the back of a truck, but let me know. Hi, Julie. Hi, can I get you? Okay. Hi, Sam. We got you. Yes. Oh, thank you. Oh, we walked about five minutes and we were offered a ride in a pickup truck. Yeah. Um, we are not purists. We're just here to see some waterfalls. Oh. All right. Yeah. That was a bumpy ride there. I don't know if that was worth it. But, um, we are out. I don't even know if that's actually saved time. But now our group has grown. Bueno, gracias. We got dropped off at this old little 
house shack I don't know but uh, you can use restroom here and uh, they have a bunch of items on a table for sale so you can get beers water Gatorade coca-cola All right, the views are getting more impressive. It's kind of opening up as we go. It's pretty steep, pretty steep downhill hike here. Hola. Hola. Is your dog? No. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there's some basic rules that we have to follow here. No littering. No, do not ingest alcohol. No glass bottles. No immoral acts. No firearms. No smoking. And you must care and respect nature. If you do that, you're fine. This waterfall is number three of four. So I think we're gonna take a trail. Whoa. We're gonna take a trail up top, up there, and uh, go check those out. And apparently there's some jumping spots. two jumps and uh wow it looks pretty high but I guess I have no choice but to go for it I'm here Kamenike waterfall falls and I'd say it's definitely worth the seven dollars worth the hike and uh yeah it's tons of butterflies saw some i've never seen before i saw one blue morpheus which has only happened to me a few times in the wild i jumped off that cliff more times than i can count and i have a lot of camera angles i'm sure one of them will look cool but yeah as far as i know we're working our way back to back to town did we get ourselves a nice cold beer, huh, Joe? Day four. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, maybe some lunch and head on back to El Tunco for nap number two. Anyway, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe. Ciao.